Hi folks, Tim here again from High End Cheap Deck. It's Friday night, so begins the weekend. Lots of videos, all shot at 1080p from now on because we have cable. Uh, read the description below to help us out so we can keep paying for that cable so we can keep producing higher quality videos. Uh, but in truth, it's going to save me money over using my phone as a hotspot. We're shooting on a Mi A2, which is now my go-to phone, my only phone I use every day. It works fantastic. The wireless charging works. And we're going to talk about a few things uh, that we have coming in. And then on the way out, we're going to talk about the Android One updates. And once again, remind you to give, give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and click the little bell icon next to subscriptions. And we're going to do this in PowerDirector on the uh, Axon M, which I'm firing up now. Mm. Exceedingly cool phone. Dual screen, by the way. And... Uh, As you'll notice, very easy to do accidental touches in, which is why it's not my daily driver. It gets a faster internet hookup than anything I own. Here to my router. It just... No way to protect those. Now, of course, I have Skinomi screens on both sides of it. And I highly recommend those. I'll probably link those in the description below too. Uh, or just go to skinomi.com. We're going to leave it at that. Uh, let's go through the intro. And we'll check out the stuff I bought that's on the way. Uh, we're going to have an unbox very shortly, Sunday morning, when the product arrives. Of course, they'll drive me nuts and say, oh, it's not here yet. And then it'll show up at like 9 a.m. Because I know the Postal Service, they're not going to work too late. So, let's do that now. Let's get to the intro and uh, the rest of the video. Thanks. All right, folks, I'm back. As I said uh, in the intro, and you'll hear again, please read the description below for links to all this stuff. I purchased this this afternoon. Uh, it's only 6.5 inches tall total when it's all folded up. It has a fill light up here. It has a Bluetooth controller and it charges via what looks to be a USB-C connector way cool and it's only 55 milliamps I can charge that through the PC here but most importantly it's a tripod which I'm sure in the opening video although I'm actually shooting this first uh, I bumped the gooseneck mount and it'll sit there and go wow, wow, wow. So, this is a good deal. You get it on Prime, it's fast, uh, it's adjustable, it's got the fill light. You can't go wrong. So, uh, that's going to be here Sunday. We'll do an unbox and a review. 
and we'll see how that works out. The other thing we're waiting on is going to be this case uh, from, hmm, who are they? Uh, uh, the wave box. It's got like four and a half stars. It'll work because of the what I'm looking for is see those great big bumpers at the bottom? That's what we're looking for. That will protect see the center where the USB C where the magic tag plugs in. It won't stick out anymore. That isn't gonna be here till about the twenty fourth. Uh You can ignore what you see on the side of this because that is the current purchasing info. It's already been shipped, but it's coming out of Shenzhen. So, as I stated before, check the description below for links I've talked about. And uh, now we're going to go back to me chit chatting about using the Axon 7 with a power director and how cool it is and the fact that I'm a little disappointed we don't have our Android uh, 10 update quite yet uh, we don't have a date but I already mentioned that in the intro let's get to that right now So as you can see we have some cool stuff coming up. We have the bandwidth now to upload, you know, high quality 1080p video for you. We need subscribers, that would be nice. Um bottom line, the Mi A2 is scheduled to get an update according to Pocket Lint. It just they don't have a date yet for it. So I don't have Android 10 yet, but I've been playing around with Android 9 and I'm perfectly happy with it. Uh, there are quite a few videos out there though that will tell you if you got Android 10 and you're not impressed, you need to rethink things. It's quite a bit faster overall. It uses less CPU. It's a fantastic operating system. Hopefully, it doesn't have too many flaws on the initial release, but it shouldn't. It's been in beta for a long time. Android Q, Android 10. It doesn't have any fancy pop-up image. Uh, it doesn't have a pie name or a cake name or a candy name or whatever so thanks for watching and getting all the way through the video and make sure you subscribe and leave us feedback we want that tell us what we're doing right what we're doing wrong what you liked what you didn't and I'll see you tomorrow with another video and we'll be tracking that tripod thing which is going to be exceedingly cool and maybe tomorrow I'll go get a haircut because this crap is driving me nuts thanks for watching catch you later